Ooh. <laughs> Hear that? What is that? It's that's the Halloween. <laughs> that's Halloween. That's Halloween coming for you. <laughs> Ooh. What? Hear that? Oh, that's the that's... Halloween uh, goblin. That that is weird, huh? Yeah. Ooh, what? <laughs> what? Weird. Halloween. Right. Halloween. 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 Okay. I. I. Hi, Zudi. Hello, Max. I have a story. It's really short. Okay. Okay. I'm fine. Um, I'm fine with that. <laughs> it's not paranormal either. Oh. It's I. I. You know. Okay. It it begins, and this is from, uh, I f- yeah, found it on Reddit. the The author has been deleted, so it's just hanging out there. Mm. No, I can't credit it to anyone now. Halloween so. got to him. Halloween got him. Halloween ate him. <laughs> ate his Reddit profile. <laughs> he ate his Reddit page. <laughs> I was he. It begins. All right, music. Hear the music. Ooh, no, it's, no. yeah. Wow, wow. I I was I was seventeen, and had just got my license. Back in high school, my friends and I had made it on. A, Jesus, I can't read today. It's, it's, it's Mulligan. All right. I was seventeen, and had just got my license. Back in high school, my friends and I had made it on a mission uh, to find abandoned houses to throw parties in. Him too. Yeah, no, I wouldn't do that. We had a few good candidates, but the mother load was this house I would pass on my way home from work. It was an undeveloped shell of a huge home with a large property in the back. I had told one of my friends about it, and the day before we went to see a movie, I took him to the house. It was about dusk in summer, so I had my headlights on, and I pulled right into the front of the house, and we were there for like 10 seconds tops before we pulled back up to go to the main road. A minute later... This big truck pulls up behind us with its high beams on, riding our ass. My friends and I took note of it, but paid no mind as we were headed back to the main road. At the light, I turned right, but the truck cut through the gas station at the corner and blocked us off. Out of the truck... Yeah. Out of the truck comes this big hulk of a man, and my friend and I are shitting our pants. He raps on the window, and I roll it down. Oh, shit. Now, the really freaky part is is that this is a busy road and there was no one in sight. He asks us what we were doing at the house and I quickly lied and I said we were making a U-turn. He stares at us for a few seconds, smiles, and sends us on our way. To this day, the house remains unfinished and I'm convinced that it's a drug operation of some sort. Finn. <clears throat> that's pretty in, that's pretty forward of a of a lad yeah to do that yeah to just what did, did he say was this at night or in the middle of the day dusk dusk yeah uh, I I can't help but just blame him that why why would you even want to go into abandoned houses <laughs> and like stay there long? But it's true. It's true. Uh, that's, yeah. I mean, I w- would you if this guy got uh, tried to block me and got out and was knocking on my I wouldn't roll my window down. I'd probably go. Yeah, I'd probably <laughs> I'd probably cry and then pop it in reverse and say I guess maybe I can reverse away from him. Yeah, when, like, I don't think I'd the window like okay, let's go. Here's how you can knife I'd... me right through the open I made just for you. Yeah, like I, I do the thing where I like tsk, tsk, on the on the window lever, so it's just down just barely. Mm. What's up? <laughs> It'd be so okay. sad if that happened, and I was in my old Ford Escort, and I'd have to do like the 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 manual like windows, like. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That was just a U-turn. U-turn, sir. <laughs> I wasn't trying to get partied partied out in that abandoned house Did this, so the truck came from down the street or from that same place or is it kind of non okay so to come to the house Dustin okay 
Pulled up to the house for about 10 seconds before we pulled back to go to the main road. A minute later, a big truck pulls up behind us with its high beams on. So maybe like parked park across the street, around or the corner, the or behind or the house saw. or something. Maybe yeah. he was like coming to that abandoned house and he saw that these guys were pulling out. Yeah, or something. Yeah. Interesting. Do you have an abandoned house story, Sudi? <laughs> I don't think I have an abandoned house story. I do. Oh my god, really? Yeah. I'm pretty sure some people have heard it before, but I had a buddy I used to ride bikes with. Bicycles, not motorcycles. Yeah. You weren't a I was a, chi- I was a goddamn child. Mm-hmm. Eight. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, I was probably... I was a teen. 20. 20? I was somewhere between 12 and 20. <laughs> okay. <laughs> And uh, there's there used to be these bunch of houses in in my hometown that were exactly like this. They were shells because they ran out of money to finish the zoning. Mm. And it was it was like a nuclear test, like fake city looking thing. It was really eerie. Oh, weird. But you know, we'd and the the roads were finished and and uh, you know and all this stuff and and but the houses were just empty. I mean, you could walk in and there was dirt, right? Mm. It, it was just like the floors were half finished and there were no windows, no doors. And uh, we liked to ride bikes in this area because it was just so strange. And and we eventually picked one to get out and sort of investigate, right? Yeah. And uh, I remember he was in front of me. I was behind him. And you go down these, you go into these houses and they were all the same. It's like tract housing, right? Mm-hmm. And... And it's a long hallway, and then there's like a room off to the right, room off to the left, right when you went in. And he went in first. He went in the room to the right, and guys, I was still you guys in... split up. No, no, he we he was like right there, but he just like ducked into that room, and I was still in the hallway. Oh, like I'm talking like you go right in the door, yeah, and there's a room to the right, mm-hmm. and he just automatically sort of went into there. And I'm still in the main hallway looking down to the center of the house. And he's probably like seven feet from me, right? Like he's not, we're not split up. Yeah. And dude, what I see is probably worse than this story. <laughs> I see I see a guy. It, and so, okay, so to paint the picture, I'm looking down the hallway and it's however long a house is, man. I don't know, 30 feet, right? Mm-hmm. Imagine just looking down a hallway of a normal house and, and you can see the back wall. And it's dark because there's no electricity or whatever, you know? Yeah. And uh, and it's super bright outside, so the inside of the house seems a little darker and, you know, just like the weird contrast. And I see this guy step from my right. And, and you know, the, the room was clearly deeper than what I could see. There's more to the room. Yeah. He comes out from wherever into the end of what I'm seeing, like at the end of the hallway. And he's just standing there looking at me. And then he walks back again to wherever he came from. And I'm like, okay, man, I don't think I want to be here anymore. (laughs) And he's like, why? Why? I said, "Ah, let's just go. And then we were on, we were running the bikes back. and And I told him, you know, it's like, there's a guy in there. Oh my God. There's a fucking guy in there. Oh my God. So yeah. he just looked at you and then walked back in to where he came? Yep. How old was the guy, you think? Oh, uh, I don't, it, you know, the desert fries people. I would say he was between 30 and 50. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, man. Hard to, hard to tell, but. And he didn't yeah, say man. anything. He just didn't looked at s- dude, you. Dude, d- just looked at me, didn't did- smile, oh. didn't frown. And it's not like I have a real clear recollection, but I don't remember any sort of gesture. And he just walked, looked at me, stared at me for, I don't know, 10 seconds, walked back into the wherever little alcove other room he came from. Wow. Uh, and I was like, okay, and man. I'm glad we did that like in the middle of the day. Had that been like nearer towards evening or something, that would have been. Yeah, you just probably wouldn't have walked back in his room at night. You probably would have walked towards you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Why didn't you just like walk back down the hallway like pump, pump, pump? Like, oh, where are you going, man? Where are you going? <laughs> <laughs> oh, if only you did that? that. Fuck is that? 
You better not be running. You better not be running. <laughs> God, that's freaky. Yeah, man. Oh, my God. Yeah. Pretty freaky. Yeah. So, anyway. Oh. That's my abandoned house story. Yeah, I don't have an abandoned house story. Yeah. I just, I, I only stumbled across the remnants of those that have been to where nobody should be. You know, never bumping <laughs> to where people actually still are. Yeah. Like I think yeah. I told you about like when you used to run the mile in elementary school in these fields and there's woods by the fields and then kids that were lazy and want to do it because the gym teacher is probably a drunk and didn't care mm. would just sit in the woods for a bit until the mile was over and you'd catch up on the last lap. Yeah, and, of course. And uh, I remember some kids and I went in there, like only like two or three of us. And uh, or three or four of us, and there was just a sleeping bag, a pair of jeans, like empty Oof. bags, like chip bags, like just against this like log in these by these trees of like yeah, there's some shit here. Like there was clothes, yeah, and and we're like oh okay, <laughs> it's all right. He's near. Let's let's get back to running the mile. <laughs> yep, just a but, couple kids. <laughs> physical fitness. Just a guy, just a homeless guy, literally sleeping feet away from where children run. Yeah, oh. yeah. But man, I never saw a guy. Yeah, saw a guy. Yeah, totally saw a guy. There's another. Time <laughs> you know what where... you should have done. Sorry, what you should have done is no, told you're your fine. friend, uh, like, hey man. I wonder what's in that room over there. You should have said that. <laughs> <laughs> you should have man. said that. Hey, hey, I think I, uh, check it out, man. And you just point. Just, and so, you, like, so the guy doesn't point. know that you're sending him over there. <laughs> it's like, yeah, man, it's cool. You know, well, I'm going to go out there and you should, uh, and you just point. <laughs> uh, all right. And you just walk outside and, and wait to hear if there's screams or a lack of screams. <laughs> yeah. It'd be eerie if it was just quiet. Yeah, what well, if you did that as a joke and you walked outside and waited and you waited and you waited and that was the last time you saw your friend? <laughs> that would be a, that'd be that'd be something, dude. Jesus. Oh God. But anyway, <laughs> that'd be good. That'd be a good opener for a horror movie or something. Yeah, yeah. It's like yeah. it. It's like fast forward to you as an adult. <laughs> <laughs> Still waiting. Yeah. Go back to the house. Oh God. Oh man. Yeah. Uh, Jesus. What were you saying before? Oh, the other one. Yeah, yeah, yeah this yeah. is. Uh, so there used to be this uh, near near one of my houses in my hometown. There used to be this hill mm-hmm. that I would go. It was like, I mean, these these are like hills, dude. Like, I would go up there and you could see everything. Like, you could see the whole town, <clears throat> every direction. And it had this rock on top that was shaped like a chair. And I like to go up there and sit in the in the chair rock and just kind of hang out. <laughs> and I was up there with, uh, God, was I with Kevin? I forget. I, f- I can't remember if it was Kevin or Justin. or It doesn't matter. I was up there with somebody. And I'm sitting up there. And uh, I remember whoever I was with says, what's that guy doing? <laughs> I'm like, what are you talking about? And also middle of the day, you yeah. know, and I get up and I look and there's this guy, he's way down there. He's like a little ant and I can vaguely hear him and he's coming right at us and he's, he's yelling something. Like, I'm the fuck? Oh, you can barely hear him. It's like, is he coming for us? I don't know. <laughs> and we're just watching him and he kind of does this. I remember him like going, he stopped the, the, the straight A to B path. And kind of went around side of the mountain or the whatever you want to call it, a mountain, but this big hill went around the base of it a bit. So we were like, okay, he's going the other side. And then he got to a rather close point. I mean, he was still a few hundred feet away. Yeah. But he was clearly like trying to get up the the hill at this point. And then he looks right up at us and he's like, you fuckers. (laughs) What? And we're like, what? He's like, I'm coming for you. I was like, why? (laughs) What? And then he starts just fucking marching up the hill. It's like, why are you doing that? And so we went down the other side of the hill and we went and hid in, you know, behind a house or something like this wasn't out in the desert. It was in a neighborhood. There's, you know, and we're just watching him and we watch him go up there and he just starts looking around, like trying to find us. What the? Don't know what the fuck that was ever about. But yeah. 
<laughs> weird. Yeah, really weird. He had a white t-shirt. I still remember it. That's the only thing I can really remember about it, is that he had a white t-shirt on. Was someone like, hey, there's some teenagers up there spying on your daughter or something? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It was really weird. Some unhinged guy just in the heat trying to chase down <laughs> some outlaws sitting in a chair. Hawk. It's not like we. <laughs> it's not like we tried real hard to get away from him or anything. I mean, we just like walked down the other side. It's just <laughs> he weird. Couldn't, he couldn't follow through on it. No, he couldn't. God. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <sighs> anyway. So that's weird. Halloween. <laughs> a little it follows action at the end there. A little bit. Yep. He's yep, still yep. trying to find you. Maybe he is, man. <laughs> you fuckers. <laughs> you fuckers. <laughs> All right. Well, uh, unless you had anything to say, man, I'm going to call this one. That's, that's that's it. End on that. You see Ghost Cat lately? No, I haven't seen Ghost Cat. Huh. No. No. Oh. Okay. You know, I think there's a there is a minor occurrence I thought uh like a few months ago, that was Ghost Cat, but I think it was just something else. <clears throat> Ghost Cat's been, I think Ghost Cat's hitting a ripe old age. Oh, I see. I think Ghost Cat's going for a second death. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Okay. And there's going to be a Ghost Ghost Cat. <laughs> but, okay, uh, well, Ghost Ghost. Yeah, all right, we'll see. It's not, it's not Halloween's Eve yet, so we'll see. That's true. That's very true. All right, guys. Ooh, oh, there it is. We better get out of here. Now I leave. Get out. Oh. No.